From the Opopka Studios in Oklahoma City, this is an OSU update. I'm Jenny Carlson. Iowa State comes to town for a homecoming game at Oklahoma State on Saturday, 11 a.m. kick time. And John Helsey joins us on the phone to talk about three things he'll be watching and three things you might want to watch for in Saturday's game. John, what tops your list this week? Well, it's, uh, it's a familiar one. It's the quarterback situation. and We've been watching this ever since Wes Lunt went down uh, against uh, Lafayette. And uh, here we go. It's, it looks like he's getting closer to being back on the field. It'll be interesting to see what his availability is this week. Is he the starter? Is he there in case uh, J.W. Walsh stumbles? I think that's, uh, it's going to be a, an important issue this week. Obviously, injury at quarterback has influenced things for Oklahoma State. Now injuries are piling up at the wide receiver position. What are you looking for at that, at that uh, spot? Yeah, who's available and who maybe is rising. You know, Tracy Moore last week out with an ankle. Isaiah Anderson last week out with a, what appeared to be a broken finger. Um, will those guys be back? Uh, I think Isaiah will. I'm not so sure about Tracy. And then who is now maybe into the spotlight there? Do they now start to maybe turn to one of these uh, freshman receivers that they like so much, C.J. Curry, a Brandon Shepard, Blake Webb. We saw a lot of Austin Hayes last week. I would think he'll be in the mix. But who is it now that uh, really has to get thrown in here and make some plays? All right, lastly, third thing to watch. What is it, John? I think it's the run game. Iowa State did a really nice job a year ago when they pulled the upset in Ames of slowing the OSU run game down and making Oklahoma State one-dimensional. Joseph Randall's having a nice season, but, again, injury there to Jeremy Smith. Uh, you know, will he be able to help? Desmond Rowland, will he be available to help? Uh, I think it's important, especially if Walsh is the quarterback, that they're able to run the ball and run the ball effectively. All right. All offensive keys to watch this week. We'll all be watching to see how the Cowboys do Saturday. Be sure to stay with the best coverage team anywhere at newsok.com and every day in the Oklahoma.